Welcome to another edition of My Arlington TV News. I'm Matthew Boyd. They're processing 25,000 packages an hour. FedEx cut the ribbon this week on a new distribution center in southeast Arlington. The 320,000 square foot facility is the last place your packages stop before arriving at your doorstep. It's big enough to load 73 trucks at once. The center has about 350 employees now with room to grow. If you've been to any big event in Arlington, you've seen them. The, mount, the police department's mounted patrol. The horses are more than just partners. They're official Arlington police officer, badges and all. In the latest episode of On the Clock, City Manager Trey Yelverson learned just what kind of training it takes to join the team. We use six horses in our unit and we train them um, on sensory training, obstacle training, uh, weapons training. It teaches the horse to be able to go out and work in public. Learn more about these amazing animals and the officers who volunteer to serve. You can see the full episode on our social media pages. And he turned his love of bikes into a business. Arlington resident Steve Burdick has been fascinated with cycling since he was a young boy. He went to a race competitively and happened to be at dinner on one night when he saw a pedicab, he signed up to be a driver and eventually started his own business here in his hometown, giving him a chance to live his dream and stay active. You can get as much exercise and as much work as you want, depending on how fast you work. I probably don't work as fast as I did at first, but uh, a lot of times the patrons want you to race and I try to stay away from that now. <laughs> You'll see Steve all around AT&T Stadium this Cowboys season, so be sure to grab a ride. We love sharing those kinds of stories, and now we have a new way to connect. Visit arlingtontx.gov slash enews and sign up for once a week email. It's an easy way to stay in touch with all the big events and good news happening in your hometown. Have a great week.